Hi, my name is Ray Pearson. I'm a professor in the Materials Science Department and director of our graduate program in Polymer Science and Engineering. It's an interesting program because it's actually a cooperative uh, program where we have faculty from chemical engineering, chemistry, material science, mechanical engineering, and physics involved in both research and teaching. The master's program in Polymer Science and Engineering can be taken completely online. It's a 30 credit hour program which is essentially 10 courses. Polymer Science and Engineering graduate program is a program and not a department. Now on campus we have participation from five departments. Um, for the online student we try to encourage you to apply through the material science department. Uh, the reason for that is that's my home department. It's easier for me to get access to the applications and I think you get more personal treatment if you go through the material science department. The program offers a PhD, a master's degree, and also a graduate certificate in polymer science and engineering. We have two types of master's degree. There's a master's of science, and the master's of science degree has a thesis requirement, and the way that we handle the thesis requirement is we actually have two advisors, one at your site, so someone from your company typically, and then someone at Lehigh and that thesis requires uh, that you publish at least one article, one paper. Um, so it's definitely research oriented, probably geared for people in industry who are working in a, a major research lab. If you're, um, you know, maybe with a consulting company, it, it may not be the degree for you. Uh, the second master's degree is a master's of engineering degree, and that degree uh, can be all coursework, and the graduate certificate is a fairly new endeavor and it's really geared for on-campus students who want exposure to polymers but want a degree in a traditional field. It's also geared for the industrial types where you might already have a graduate degree but you're working in a polymer environment and you just want that uh, little bit of depth to, to help you succeed at your job. Just to be associated with a that the history of fracture mechanics was, was appealing. The, the other issue was actually in my home department, which is material science, is we have one of the largest uh, buildups of electron microscopes in the country, at least in one centralized location. So for my research, uh, I look at fracture mechanisms, and I use electron microscopy to look at the fracture mechanisms. So having some of the best scopes in the world was, was definitely a, a, an attraction for me. Thank you.